So I just realized we're starting off this episode with some sad music, and it might end up being the finale. <laughs> Good evening, everyone. I'm Marquez, and welcome back to the Pokemon Fire Red Randomizer Warp Nuzlocke. Warp Randomizer Nuzlocke. Ra Even to the end, I can't get the full title right. Isn't that great? Anyway. <laughs> we're here in Lavender Town, and uh, basically what we're going to do today is I'm going to be... I'm probably we're going to be doing a time lapse of training, and then if we've got time at the end, uh, we're going to start taking on the Elite Four. Uh, we've already beat two of them. We got two left, and then we know we also know where the champion is as well, so we can go fight him if we need to. This might be a long video, or I'll cut it after the after the time lapse, and uh, we'll see. Put it on screen yeah, if, if if it's cut. <laughs> Put it on screen if it's uh, cut uh, where it's cut to, or if it's fully cut out. You know. Uh, sorry, not the right phrasing at all. I'm bad at this. Uh, <laughs> play on screen where the time lapse ends or if it's the whole video. There we go. That's what I meant to say. Anyway, onwards with the time lapse, I guess. I'll see you when I get back with it. This is probably going to take me forever. What the hell just happened? What the hell just happened? You're gonna my he my health tank. What the fuck has happened? Two hundred health, dropped to zero. What was he at before it happened? I think it used explosion or self destruct. As it died as well. I wasn't paying too much attention. Holy crap. He just went down. Dude, he was my high it was my second highest level. Katsumaki wasn't even that high. Everybody else loses health like crazy, so I put Yokozuna in because it doesn't you lose that much health. Also, that that goes my leftovers. Leftovers was a really good item, and put on Yuka's unit because it has a lot of health, so it could recover pretty a lot. I even use a lemonade on it as well. Like, it, it, it had to be over, yeah, it had to be over two hundred health at the start of that fight. The hell? How? I'm gonna have to watch that back. This is just a cut in the middle of the thing where I freaking lost my freaking. Brah! Okay, new team member, I guess. Uh, this was a completely unexpected cut in the freaking. Honestly, thought I was just going to be sitting here doing the whole time lapse thing. This is a completely unexpected cut in the time lapse. Oh my god. Why was it. What? How? That's what I get for not paying attention. No idea what caused it. Oh my god! Okay, yeah, Tatsumaki has the same level. That was my health tank! What the hell? I guess Blastoise will have to serve as my uh, health tank now. Or just general tank. Damn it! This is a terrible timing because this is nearly the end of the game. I don't have anything near these levels. It's gonna make the time lapse last longer. Cause I gotta find somebody that can get to that freaking level and be strong. Do I got another fighting type anywhere? I think you're a fighting type, aren't you? 
I don't know if you have a lot of health, though. Get yeah, grass fighting. Get yeah, blaze kick. Hm. I'll be worth it, but that <laughs> still take forever to get it up to the freaking level. That's if it's a tank at all. I don't actually know if it's a tank. I don't know if 65 is good health for level 25. Or not. I doubt it, but... I mean, Magikarp's not a good comparison, but... 48. Uh, better Magikarp. No, I didn't mean to... I didn't need to hit no. I was like trying to cancel out of no, and it cancelled out of the whole menu instead. Uh, I can't put it off. Fucking... And there goes my leftovers as well. Sorry, Yokozuna. All it takes is to lose one fight. And you're no longer Yokozuna. <laughs> God damn it. Fuck. I mean, if we're going for a health tank, Bonnie might be a good one to go with. Right? I'm pretty sure Bonnie has a lot of health. Right? Is that not right? Its defensive stats are fairly high, I think. And let's compare it to... I don't really have anyone to compare it to. Where's Bonnie? Where's Bonnie? There's Bonnie. It would have a wide moveset it could use. Oh, Water Pulse is nice. Lowers may also lower a per. Ooh. Got some good moves. Jumbo. Let's see. Jumbo's got Earthquake. Ooh. We need to have a fighting type move, right? <laughs> Let me look at your moves. We might go with Jumbo. Uh, Bonnie, sorry. Okay, look at its health. 152. 185, obviously, that's higher. 155. It's got higher health than Tatsumaki. Because I am, well, it's seven levels lower, so it's going to have higher health. And we haven't put any stats into anything yet, so... That's a thing. I don't know if it'll be higher than Quadris or not, when it gets to it. At least the guy that gets it to 200 or so. At least. To make it into the... I got quite a few tanky-like Pokemon. Which might not be a bad idea. Honestly, tanky Pokemon tend to survive a lot more. And it's kind of what we're after. Piloswine a uh, tanky Pokemon? Kind of would like to avoid Pokemon with multiple typings. Just to make it easier to work around them. What about Stantler? I don't know. I don't know what's tanky. <laughs> How about Dumbo? Uh, not sure if Dumbo's tanky or not. I'm at a loss here. I think we're going to go with Bonnie just because its level is near. Uh, it was one of the legendary catches, like, when we were finding the legendary Pokemon. I'm gonna have to move Mark Bonnie into the front. I can't believe Tatsumaki got for all that, and freaking. <sighs> because Zuna didn't. I think this is still a decent moveset. 
Not 100% accurate. I'd probably replace Thunder with something a bit more accurate. But other than that, it's not a bad move there. Potential for confusion and a potential for uh, lowering accuracy and then also poison. Using those three in conjunction would make a dangerous freaking. Well, I guess you can't. Like, no, you can confuse and you can poison. And then if you lower accuracy, ooh. It's stuck in a cycle where it's just losing health. Or hitting itself. What I'll do is I'll use my HP ups, which uh, should increase the HP stats. And this will at least give Barney a chance of being a higher health. They got rid of the other. Under 55, it now matches Tatsumaki's health, which Tatsumaki is seven levels higher at this high stage, which means it's probably going to go more than that. It's probably going to, it's probably going to go higher than Quadris, who has my current highest health. Which I didn't even think. Is Quadris a bit of a health tech? Oh no, not quite, because the other one had like 240 something. Like, <laughs> that freaking other Pokemon had huge ones. Bonnie's also a single form evolution, which could hurt it a lot. But we'll see. Uh, oh, moveset. Uh, let's see what I've got in terms of TMs. I could use. I don't think I have any electric ones. more health you got, the more power. No? Okay. Didn't matter anyway. I couldn't use it. Lead seed to combo with your other moves. So they're poisoned, seeded, confused, and uh, accuracy loss. God, can you imagine that as a full certain strategy? As a tank strategy? <laughs> Yeah, we need to see if it got if it can get any fighting moves. A dark. You go with dark? No. Can you learn anything? Oh, jump kick! Damn it! Can't learn jump kick. Okay. That thrash. He's able to learn thrash. How about hyper beam? I'm gonna just put hyper beam on rather than the electric move, just because I don't know. Because it does like 150, but it's also more, far more accurate. 20% more accurate. Also, a lot of I sludge. It doesn't seem like a lot it can use. Use icy wind. So you can use ice. Crap. Fuck. Explosion. <laughs> Can it learn Surf? It can learn Surf. If we want a strong move, that's going to be mostly water type moves. We already have a water type with a water with Surf on. I don't think we need this one to have Surf. Uh, strength. You can learn Strength. Strength is a good move. 80 power. Normal type move. Most not not many things. Uh... Surf is better because. It's Stronger, but the, you, you don't get all the water problems. They learn fly. I don't know what they can learn because I, don't, I think they're, what they can learn is actually randomized as well. You can learn cut, but we don't care about that. So should, I re should I replace that move with rank? The great thing is normal types don't have that many weaknesses. The weakness is only fighting, which I don't think there was any on that other route, so we're good on that respect. <laughs> Uh, Muddy Water and Sludge Bomb. I want to keep Sludge Bomb. I might keep 
water pulse just because of the confused potential. I kind of want muddy water because it's the highest damage output. Oh wait, hold on. Let's check something first. What's its attack? And uh, its special attack. Its special attack is higher than its attack. Ah, okay. In that case, we might want to keep Thunder, actually. Special attack is higher, so it's actually got a good set for it. I don't know if Sludge Bomb is good, because uh, I might be more physical. Alright, if it's more of a special attacker, uh, some of these other moves might have done... Icy Wind could be useful. This is the lowering the speed slab thing. Hyper Beam isn't as useful now because of that revelation. We don't have any fighting moves we can teach it either, which is a problem. Water Spout would be really good, but you can't learn that either. Yeah, there's not really a huge amount else it should really be taught. I just leave it with its current move set. Uh, I better heal. Sorry. Sorry about the noise. I just speed that up just to get past the heal suddenly. All right, with our team currently as it is, Bonnie is the currently lowest level. I'm gonna have to train up Bonnie first and then continue everything else because uh, uh, <laughs> we barely got into the freaking training and I'm already freaking down one guy. I don't think there's anything I can equip onto Bonnie. Uh, what have we got in our berry case? Unless it's just ingredients for medicine. Let's go with confusion. Give you, give you something that can prevent confusion. I didn't mean to use it, I meant to give a one to also to Meta B. I don't think I've got that many hold items. Or access to that many hold items, so I don't really have any reason to have Pokemon hold items. Alright, we're going to see if we can train up Bonnie. If that fails, we may have to get another Pokemon in the team, but I'm pretty sure, hopefully, Bonnie can handle it. Let's hope it can take over for Yokozuna. So I'm going to head back to the training area and uh, hope everything isn't screwed up. Well, I'll see you there. Back to the, back to the time lapse. <laughs> <sighs>
That's my problem. I don't know what's tanky. The third form tanky is in a cactus tanky. Tech turn might be. I have to train in a different area. There's no way that area. I, I, there's no way I can properly train in that area. I'm just gonna keep losing Pokemon one after another from whatever move that ends up being. I gotta find out what that move is. Get a freaking. Oh, I'll be pissed. I didn't see it every single. Both times it happened. Okay, we're bringing Peaches back in. I know, I know it's a Pokemon we have. It's a low, it's a low level. I'm gonna have to train it up fully. But I can't have this. Not, not, no, I can't have this. Well, that was poor timing. Oh god, is that gonna happen all the time? I'm not gonna be able to do a full recording if that keeps happening. <laughs> He's going to need a lot of stuff replacing. You know what? I'm going to do that during the time lap because I've just realized... Uh, yep. Wait. Is that an actual... Wait. Is that like a thing with a thing attached to it? That's a pain. Uh, that is a pain that that keeps that started happening now. Uh, okay, so we're gonna do the montage. I'm gonna do all the other stuff during the montage. Uh, not montage. Uh, I keep calling it montage. It's a uh, time lapse. We do it during the time lapse. So I'm not. Don't have to deal with that noise. It keeps coming up. But I'll see you in the time lapse. <laughs>
And we're back. <laughs> so I found out, I actually went through some of the footage and uh, I found out that uh, it was Destiny Bond. I prob you've probably already seen it come up on the screen already if you've watched the previous starting part. But yeah, it was Destiny Bond that kept killing my, my Pokemon. Literally, the health didn't matter. Uh, as soon as the enemy died, so did my Pokemon. That's what happened. They didn't use anything specifically powerful. So... It was literally just the fact that I wasn't paying attention. Uh, so it's good I didn't go back there to continue training because uh, we found a nice little pocket that actually was pretty good for experience, actually. Uh, and uh, my Pokemon were good at defeating them. So I trained my Pokemon up. They are currently... That affects that whole uh, thing. They are currently all at level 63 except for War, who started at 71 to begin with. Uh, what I plan to do... Uh, I plan to take on the rest of the Elite Four plus the champion. Uh, and I want to basically try and defeat them with these. Because they're all level 63. The champion's highest level Pokemon is 63. So there's a good chance I'm going to be... I'm probably going to get through it easily. But at the same time, there is a chance that I will struggle with at least one of their Pokemon. Maybe a couple. So who knows. Depends on whether they get legendaries or whatnot. It's all randomized. And uh, I don't want... Just in case some more stuff happens here, I, I don't want anything. Because there was some uh, stuff going on outside my room I didn't realize was going to be happening today. And that kind of got involved when I had to stop the recording to do other stuff. Uh, so what we're going to do is we're going to end the video off. You'll have probably already know this from the start. Uh, we're going to end the video off and uh, we'll do the full finale next time. And if I manage to beat them pretty quickly... We'll go on and we'll go through the uh, Cerulean Cave and we'll take on the level 70. We'll have beat it at that point. We'll beat the, the challenge run. But we'll take on the level 70 and see if we can defeat that because then that's well above our levels. So we can go and do that after we've been the Elite Four if we, if we defeat him too quickly. If we don't defeat him that quickly, we're just going to defeat him and then beat the champion and then finish. But if, it, if it's if it's easy peasy, lemon squeezy sort of thing, we'll go take on the level 70. And I will refuse to use my level 71 until I have defeated it. Until the rest of my Pokemon are down. So that'll be a cool, interesting uh, fight where I'm at a disadvantage if we end up with that. Otherwise, if they're challenging enough to take a long time, they're, they're challenging enough to take a long time. And we are going to continue this next time. Uh, I'm actually going to walk out. We're actually go. I was going for the whole humble beginnings thing. This is our humble beginnings, and then we'll we'll, we'll head on to the league. We'll have our final fights. I won't really be in the league. I'm actually going to find out where each one of the Elite Four are. There are two entrances to each one, and we know where the champion is in Cerulean, the back of the uh, dig house. <laughs> anyway, thanks everyone so much for watching. Uh, if you skipped all the way to the end, fair enough. <laughs> It's, a, it's just a time lapse for this is practically the entire episode. But if you missed the bits at the start, you may notice our Pokemon are different. Go back. Go watch the bit where I fucked up. Yeah, we, we lost... Uh, uh, the Yokozuna. We lost Yokozuna. And I replaced it with... with uh, the, the, the Licky Tongue called um, I've completely forgotten what the Licky Tongue was called and we had to replace that one with Peaches <laughs> which also has the same health as Quadri so it's not as tanky as the previous one in terms of health but uh, Peaches does have some high defensive stats but that's a positive not as high as Quadri but uh, pretty high and some nice physical attack and some coverage that coverage worked out well for us to be fair uh so, uh, thanks so much, for, so much for watching. For now, we're done here. I will see you in the finale. See ya.